Hey guys, what is up? Smokey Games here, and I'm bringing you a uh, different kind of video this time. It's not really a gaming video, but it's uh, about a game. This is about the Elder Scrolls Online um, game. Uh, can I, it's just come out uh, the 14th of the 4th of the 14th, um, and uh, in this video, I'm just going to be, you know, asking the question: Is it worth it? And the straightforward answer is no, not really. Firstly, let's just look at the price because, you know, the price kind of determines what kind of audience you're going to go for um, and how many players you're going to get, really. So, it determines the quality of the game as well, you know, if you have a high cost game like GTA 5 or something, it's pretty expensive, like 50 quid or something, but that's a good game. So, you know, the higher the price, the better the game should be. But, in this case, some people get it wrong. Um, it's 50 quid to buy, which is pretty expensive, you know, for some people. Uh, for quite a lot of people, really. And then it's 8 quid every month subscription. I've got, like, no... nothing against subscription, you yeah? know? Because, you know, World of Warcraft, all those kind of games where you have to pay a subscription. But, um... The game's got to be good for you to be able to pay, play a subscription. And, I mean, The Elder Scrolls Online, let's just put it you know, straightforward here, it's it's not a good game. Um, it's got pretty bad ratings, and, I mean, everyone is not very happy with it at all in any way. Uh, firstly, f firstly, that's price. No one's happy about the price. You know, if it was a great game like that, probably people, if it was a good game, you know, people would be like, um, yeah, you know, I'll pay, pay whatever it takes to get that game. Because, I mean, I'm an Elder Scrolls fan. I've, you know, I've played Skyrim for over a thousand hours, which is kind of addictive. Um, and I've played, you know, all the other, um, Oblivion, you know, Daggerfall, um, Morrowind, you know, all, all the other ones. So, you know, I know what a uh, Elder Scrolls game should be, you know, I, I, I know what a multiplayer game should be, because I play a lot of multiplayer games as well, like World of Tanks, for instance, even though it's less of a RPG, to be honest. You know, I, I've played a lot of other games like Lord of the Rings Online, Star Wars The Old Republic, and stuff like that, and both of those games that I've just mentioned, uh, I haven't played for long at all, because let's just no PvP really. The thing that makes a, um, a a good multiplayer game is the PvP. You know, if we take World of Warcraft for example, this is why it's managed to hold its player base for so long. You know, you hear people playing, been playing it for like six, seven years. You know, before they eventually quit, and they're like 30 or something. Um, it's because you know you can do whatever you want. You can go out there, you can kill whoever you want to kill, you know, you can start a war with whoever you want to start, you can be who you want to be, you can be what faction you want to be, you can be part of a faction, if you want to declare war on someone, you can do that, you know, it's that kind of, um, excitement, you know, going down a road and then you turn a corner and you see you know, the enemy, you see six enemy players, you know, charging at you, and you have to run for your life. Um, I mean, th that's the excitement there, you know, you're hunting enemy players down, you know, it's fun, you're up against other players. And I mean, when you're just going up against NPCs, um, they, they run towards you just shouting, free kill, free kill here! Um, I mean, it's, it's it's stupid, because you get no joy out of killing an NPC. NPCs are there to make the world look larger, you know, that they make the world look more, there's more stuff in the world, that's what it makes them, that's why they're there, they're, they're just there so you can grind them, you know, so you can maybe get a, a kind of a skill level, you can get your skills up and stuff, they're not there to just play, just to kill the whole game, they're, they're not, in a multiplayer game they are not there just to kill, you know, that's not the whole point of the game, you know. The point of PvP, uh, the point of a uh, multiplayer game is the PvP, and I think Elder Scrolls—they've got it completely wrong. 
for the for the first thing is yeah, there's no PvP in the world except for an off kind of island off Cyrodiil where you have where it gives you a sign you know it gives you a pop up saying do you want to enter there is PvP you know I don't care yeah I don't care I want PvP I want to kill people yeah and it's stupid like it's absolutely ridiculous that. PvP is just like not allowed in the world. The the, the trailer is very misleading because you know I thought it would be like a whole rush nations fighting against nations. You know you're out there with your squad or something, your group of archers, and you you know you come across enemy kind of groups and stuff like that, or big assaults on castles and stuff like that, and it all looked really cool. And then like they just came out with no, you're not allowed to, and it's it's ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. I mean they've got it completely completely wrong. I would have liked to see, you know, mass scale wars and everything, you know, between factions, you know. Obviously you're going to have to have some safe zones, you know, the safe zones of your kind of area. But, like, have a look at Planet Side 2. Yeah, that is PvP. You know, you go out there, you don't know where the enemy are, you kind of know where they are, but, you know, they can be anywhere on the map. And that's the excitement there, you know, you go over a ridge and you see, you know, an enemy sniper or something and you have to take him out. You know, it's something like that. And then there's these mass scale battles. It's, it's exciting, guys. But this, this Elder Scrolls, it's, it's not. It's rubbish. Absolutely rubbish. And, I mean, no one... Is enjoy like I can't actually play it. For, like I got onto the beta test, yeah, and I can't actually, I couldn't play it for more than an hour straight, and that's saying something, you know. I couldn't just kill. See, you're just killing NPCs the whole time. It's boring, absolutely boring, and the actual system of um, fighting system, you know. All, all, all the, uh, I forgot what the word for it is, but the, 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 the fighting system, yeah? It's rubbish. Uh, like, go watch a video on the, just the fighting system and, and you'll see it's absolutely rubbish. It's not what they said it would be. You know, it's it's completely, utterly, it's nothing like Skyrim's. It's like worth, it's worse. It's like ten times worse. It's, um, it's kind of like the, uh, it's like worse than Morrowind. Oh, Morrowind's um, system. It's horrible. And I know there are limits with multiplayer games, but they could have done so much better. You know, Bethesda, you know, Zenimax screwed this up. You know, it wasn't Bethesda, because Bethesda basically gave it over to Zenimax. And Zenimax were like, okay, let's screw this game up really bad. Um, you know, they weren't like that, but it's... This is... I'm basically saying... Don't get the game unless you really want to. I mean, if you are really wanting to get the game, just go out and watch a few videos on other other videos, and I bet you they'll tell you exactly the same thing. You know, this game sucks. Seriously, this game sucks, and I bet you, I bet you, in a year it will be free to play. I mean, I'm not joking there. They won't have the player base to keep the game running. It will be free to play in a year. Um. There's no doubt about it. Mark my words, it's going to be free to play in a year. So, um, yeah, uh, thank you for listening, guys. I hope you've kind of enjoyed my views on this. Um, it's kind of, I wouldn't say it's an informative video. It's more of a rant, rage about how bad Zenmax is. Um, and how bad the other... Like, I was really, really, like... I wanted it, like, when it came out, I was like, you know, for a year, for a whole year before it came out, I was, like, waiting for it, you know, I was really excited for it, but, and then when it came out, it was like, oh, right, okay, it's crap, you know, and I, I didn't even, I'm, I'm not buying it, there's no way I'm going to buy it, unless they dramatically change something, which they're not going to do, I'm not buying it, there's just no way, absolutely no way. So uh, thank you guys for listening. And